It's a missing puzzle piece, we think. Brandon Jutras and his research team at Virginia Tech making this discovery that could completely change the way Lyme disease is treated. This is actually the bacteria that causes Lyme disease. As that bacteria multiplies, they found it sheds a cellular component that causes Lyme arthritis, an extremely painful condition and the most common late stage symptom of the disease. We think that it, it may be a, an important molecule to consider moving forward and that if we could prevent the patients from responding or cr creating this inflammatory response to this molecule or just get rid of the molecule entirely, that these patients will get better faster. Good news for an increasingly infected population. The CDC says 300,000 people in the U.S. are diagnosed with Lyme disease every year. The number of cases up more than 6,000 percent in the last 15 years in Virginia. In this area, extremely common. Yeah, it's that's part of the problem. But as the problem grows, so now are the solutions. This latest finding likely leading to new ways to diagnose and treat Lyme disease. And that's just the beginning. This particular discovery is opening the doors for many other possible avenues of research. And, and that is, is the most exciting part. Reporting in Blacksburg, Virginia, I'm Jessica Jewell.